So TerraCycle is located in Trent, New Jersey. Uh, this is our global headquarters, but we do operate now in 26 countries around the world, all the way from uh, offices in Tokyo to Sao Paulo and many countries in between. What TerraCycle's mission is, is to eliminate the idea of waste. Now, that's a pretty lofty thing, and the way we try to do that is to create collection programs and solution uh, pro uh, systems for hard-to-recycle waste streams, things that you couldn't just put in your normal blue box. Things could be like potato chip bags, which we collect in five countries, all the way to used cigarettes, which we now recycle in nine countries. We collect uh, uh, billions of pieces of waste uh, uh, every year. Uh, we have 60 million people participating in our programs. And TerraCycle is a completely free platform. You go to TerraCycle.com and you can help recycle your non-recyclable waste completely for free. Uh, we've covered your shipping for you through funding from brand partners and in many cases give a small donation for every piece of waste you collect. TerraCycle is not about the products we make. Now we do make thousands of unique products from shower curtains to shoes to railroad ties to uh, industrial products. But we don't even want you to buy anything from us because buying is what creates waste. What we're really proud of is our collection programs. Uh, so uh, uh, being able to uh, uh, recycle everything from cigarettes to juice pouches to cosmetic waste, these are the things that really get us very excited. Well, TerraCycle started 10 years ago. Um, honestly, my friends and I, uh, we were uh, freshmen at uh, university and uh, we started growing some plants in our basement. We couldn't quite get them to work until one day we started feeding worm poop to our plants. And worm poop is organic waste fed to worms. Uh, commonly called worm castings, we just happen to call them worm poop, and it uh, made the plants grow very well. So TerraCycle started as a company, uh, I ended up dropping out of school, uh, and uh, TerraCycle started as a fertilizer company, taking you, uh, worm poop and packaging it in used soda bottles. And we built that business over four years to about three and a half million dollars of various worm poop fertilizers. And we realized right around 2007 that the real magic of our business wasn't to be a fertilizer company, uh, uh, but was to reimagine the concept of waste. And if we could make a fertilizer out of garbage, the question was, could we make anything out of garbage? And then if you can make anything out of garbage, then there really is no such thing as garbage as long as you collect it and find purpose for it, find value for it. And that's where, uh, how it began and where we are today. TerraCycle is fundamentally an innovation company. Uh, so the way our business works is uh, we start with a type of garbage, say cigarette butts. Then we have a team of designers who looks at how we can either reuse or upcycle the cigarette butts. That's more a design question. Then we have a team of scientists at our own laboratory looking at how we can recycle cigarettes, which is more of a science question. But it's tremendous innovation because everything TerraCycle has done, whether it's recycling used chewing gum, used cigarettes, even chip bags or juice pouches and pens, we invented the process. So we rely on this uh, innovation in a big way. And I think the first question is then, how do you encourage more innovation? And you can see by walking around our office, we're very hip, very cool, very flat, and very transparent. And I think transparency, uh, uh, but also a really good environment that facilitates creative thinking allows this uh, uh, to occur. And then especially allowing people to make mistakes, because innovation, uh, true innovative wins, come on a foundation of many, many mistakes. There's absolutely no limit to our system. We have found recycling solutions to absolutely everything. Even next year, we're going to be rolling out fem hygiene programs, uh, which is maybe the pinnacle of consumer waste streams, uh, but even complicated business-to-business -business, uh, or factory-based waste streams. There's nothing that can't be recycled. 